Okay, this is how to get a uh, link for a uh, for, to get your customers to write Google reviews for you or to just rate you with the five star rating um, or with their star five star rating system. So uh, what I did is I went to this Google review link. I, I went to Google and said Google review link, or you could say on website, whatever. But I found this this uh, support page right here on Google. And let's take a look at it. It's someone asked the question probably, and but this is the link up here that you can see to go to these instructions right here. Um, and so this tells you exactly how to do it. Um, so what we want to do here is put a button on our own website or have a link that we could email to somebody to say, hey, if you if you would write us a review or rate us, that would be great. And the idea is to have. Um, customers of yours that are happy with your product or service to, to rate you so that you get good reviews and you don't ask for reviews from people who don't like you. So so here's what we do and the instructions are right here. So first you go to the Google Places API, okay? And that is, um, you can see on the bottom, it says developers.google.com slash places slash place dash ID. So we'll go there. And then you would type in your business, database systems, Alexandria, you choose that. Okay, and then here we have our place ID, so we would copy that. All right, copy this whole thing. I just want to copy this right here. Okay, copy. All right, and then the instructions down here say what you need to do then. This is going to be your link. Um, it says write review question mark place ID equals, which would look just like this then without those little um, less than and greater than signs. So I'm going to just throw this into a notepad document here and show you exactly how that would look for mine because I'm actually going to do this on my website. So there's my ID and then I also need this part here. Okay, and so I copy that put that right there um, just a little wider here okay so there's my link so now if I go into my website I just need to copy this link here and I'll show you how to do that as well okay on my website I'm using a page builder to change stuff and so let's say I just want to add a button. I want to add a big button like this that says um, um, do a review for me or whatever. So I'm going to use a button and I'll put that probably right here, I guess. And so the link that I copied, that goes there. And I'll probably say go to a new, open in a new window. Um, the text for my button, here's my button right here. I want to say, um, uh, let's see, click, click to rate us, or click to rate us on Google. Okay, and then I want a different color. I want to change stuff here a little bit. All right, so I have my uh, button down here. I'm going to go back up here and remove. I was going to put it up here, but I decided to put it down here. All right. All those changes. So now I've got a button on my website that says click to rate us on Google. And when I click that, you will see, hopefully, yeah, so a rate and a review. So someone can come in here, give me five stars, and they can type a comment. They could even put a photo in there, I guess. But um, this is really valuable because um, if, uh, let's see, I'll show you what I mean here. Um, so if I type in web host, web hosting, web design, let's see here. Okay, notice that I'm showing up here. These are all ads up here, but searching for web design, uh, I'm showing up on the top spot. And part of the reason helps that part of the reason that I'm showing up pretty good is that I've got ratings. And so 
if you have ratings, that helps you show up higher. And if you have better ratings, it probably helps you show up higher. Now, it isn't only the ratings that matter, but that's one thing that matters. So if your competition doesn't have ratings and you do, then you may have a little bit of an edge. So I hope that helps you and uh, let me know if you got questions.